Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hey, Mom. If you're watching this next episode, I just want you to know um, I do love you. In all seriousness, yes, I do love my mom. I love you, Mom. You're one of the most important people in my life. You're amazing. Thank you for helping shape the person I am today. I wouldn't be so happy and, uh, what's the word? Uh, Pretty just looking fresh. I, I wouldn't be as enlightened and happy as I am today without your constant love and affection and wise knowledge. So, thank you for that, and I love you, Mom. Damn, my mom and I like to beat each other up. <laughs> Every Saturday we get together, and she takes a bunch of steroids, and I take a bunch of cocaine, and then we fight in the octagon until one of us um, <laughs> has, a, has a broken uh, arm. Is this freaking... This is like, I'm like, Mom, are you ready? She's like, I will get your ass in. And then we're like, Stop. And then Goku comes and he's like, Stop. And then fucking Luffy from One Piece is like, I am going to go with the Pasuka. And then it's just fucking crazy. Is this like your Fight Club fan fiction? Not a fan fiction. Not a fan fiction. Who did that? Yeah, yeah. Okay, anyways. Every Saturday, Octagon Fight Club. Well, your mom, that, that just sounds like negative energy, Elliot. Anyways, I wanted to continue this episode talking about something. In between recording, we talked about somebody who has a bit of an obsession. Not my mom. She's not obsessed with it. We were talking about somebody else who has a bit of an obsession with... A friend's aunt. Who has an obsession with uh, positive energy and having no negative energy in her house whatsoever. Yeah, she, like, drinks filtered water. Not because she wants to, like, filter out toxins or some shit. Um... Like, because it's holy? No, not because it's holy. She thinks that there's, like, literally physical particles of, like, good and bad energy. And she's like, I have to drink this water because it filters out the bad energy in the water. I'm like, you, okay. look at the, like, you look at it under a petri dish and you see the, <laughs> the, the cells that have smiley faces and the other <laughs> ones that have brownie faces. I, those brownie face ones can go to hell. Oops, I'm sorry. Send me your energy, Goku. And what, what, what'd you say? I need to fight Piccolo. What, what was it she she said about swearing? If somebody oh she in says house. yeah if somebody swears in her house. I was never around when she said this, but I was told this by my friend. Um, yeah, she's like, you're putting negative energy into my house. You're not allowed <laughs> to do that. Like, go okay. See, see, the reason I wanted to continue talking about this. First of all, I wanted to clarify that I do indeed love my mommy. Of course, we. Anyways, all right, we get it. You guys smash. Okay. <laughs> Okay, anyways. Oh, Jesus. Um, so... Totally fucking kidding. For the no, record. No, no, he's if not. that needed no, he's not. to be said. No, it's not. So, <laughs> I came prepared. Time to blow that fucker up. So, I, I, I want... Your dick in that? So, I wanted to talk about um negative and positive energy. Now, I myself, I, I may not be as, like, much of a psycho as, uh, like, this, that, that we'll lady... We'll call her Brunhilda. Okay. That lady you were just talking about, Brunhilda. But I, I myself am, uh, I care a lot about negative and positive energy, and I think that all comes, it comes down especially to, like, your emotions. And if somebody says, no, don't bring any negative emotions into my house, don't say anything. Like, does she get, does she get upset when, like, I don't know, I fucking met her like once. See, the, the thing is, people who, if you've seen the movie Inside Out by Pixar, You'll know what I'm talking about. The, the moral of that movie. Have you seen Inside Out? Yeah. Actually, I have. Oh, wow. That's... Yeah, Jen and I saw that in the theaters. It was sad. Are you... Wow. That's... Oh, I've man, the part... Once every million moons, yeah. the planet's alive, and Elliot does actually go out and see a movie. Dude, spoiler alert, so <clears throat> skip, like, 30 seconds if you don't want to hear a spoiler. Like, the part there in the trash pit, and then her imaginary friend has to, Bing like... bomb. Yeah, has to oh get stuck. That made me so sad. I know. That made me so sad. Cause like, oh. Bing Bong was like my favorite character in that mm -hmm. movie. So, it's... end spoiler. End spoiler. Spoiler's over. So, so and, oh fuck me, that wasn't. So, yes, please. So what I was gonna say was um. So when people say like, it, fuck. So when people say uh, I don't want any negative energy at all. Like if if somebody is in their house and hypothetically, wait, what the fuck? Oh, oh! I don't have enough notes. Okay, you know what, Elliot? Need five fucking notes. You know what, Elliot? We gotta go back to Terry Dacky. No! We do. No, go get five notes! Uh, okay.
Okay. Go for it, firm note. You want to do this the hard way? Yeah. Okay. Make it hard. On my nippers. Okay, next recording session, we're going to Terry Dacky Land. No? Well, yeah, after we beat this bitch. After we beat this whole level? Yeah, we need to get it out of the way. This Are is you crazy. This is the craziest fucking hardest level. If we get this out of the way, it'll. But we won't be able to beat everything without. Oh, yeah, I didn't describe my fucking feelings of positive energy. Oh, oh, wait, but. Oh, wait, I wasn't done. <laughs> Okay, anyways, <clears throat> put your nips in there, it'll feel so, good. So, so when people, when people say, no, I don't want you to hear, I don't want to hear any crying or anger at all. I, I, I don't want you to have any negative emotions at all. Do people that actually was, say that? Some people do, because, like, it just, it really bothers me when people try to suppress those feelings. Like, some people, like, everybody does to a degree, but then there are people who actively try to fight off. It's like, no, you can't cry at all. You can't feel jealous. You can't feel this. That's a negative emotion. It just causes negative energy. It does nothing but bad. It's like, no, fuck off. Seriously, those, if, if you feel a certain way about Wait, something. Aren't you going to get, the, you have enough notes. Oh, thank you, Elliot. G Elliot's my GPS for this episode. Um, that's a lie. I can't count. That was that was. Uh, I did not say that. Um, I don't care if I go away. So, I I just want to say, people who are uh, really obsessed with positive energy, just know it's okay to be sad or mad or you could be that bunny or just talk or disgusted or scared. Mm -hmm. It's totally okay to have any of those feelings and. To try and suppress that, I mean, that's kind of the whole message of Inside Out. Don't suppress those feelings. And if people like, you know, the ant you were telling me about, or what, yeah, yeah, are, are yeah. really like that with Revealed like feelings and negative emotions yeah. and negative energy and whatever, sure. tell, just tell them the fuck off. It's like, dude, you know what? I'm not gonna. What the? You lied. I figured it was like. <laughs> Okay, uh, it can happen more than once. Oh! I was wrong. Also, uh, oh, sorry. Uh, uh oh, I, I just need oh, to say open this. this front door. Let me just say this one last thing yeah. and then I'll be done. Uh, don't. So yeah, if, if you have those negative feelings, it's okay to have them. Don't feel ashamed for feeling the way you do about things. Just be honest with yourself. And, like, as somebody who, you know, went, has been through his life, and is it in the 20s? What? All of the grand fucking wizardry and knowledge of a 20 year old. I'm 24, thank you very much. <laughs> I'm just saying that's not yeah, very far in your life, man. I don't, so what? I, by the way, I like the picture every time those pigs open their mouth, they're like, Come here, Peter. <laughs> I know you do. Are there pigs? I don't know what Yeah, they are. they're pigs, dude. Are they? Yeah, they're pigs. Uh, where they, they don't have their. Uh, no, uh, they, they don't look like, what's his name? Crispy Bacon from the last one. <laughs> Crispy Bacon. That's a piggy. They're pigs. Really? Yeah. Where are you going? going? Yeah, look, look, look. They're like warthogs. Pigs don't have... Yeah, yeah, they're pigs. they're totally warthogs, dude. They're not. Yeah, warthogs, warthogs have fangs. They don't have... What? Tusks. tusks. They have tusks. tusks. Yeah. Look. Man. No, they're totally fucking warthogs. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> You're not... No, I am totally serious. What the fuck is I always at? thought they were like... <laughs> okay, I'm done now. Do you not think they're pig dudes? No, I, I just thought they were monsters. I always thought they were pig dudes. Pig dudes! Skidoosh! Well, nice. Now for Elliot's take on that. If you have negative energy... You're gonna make me cry. You better not have any fucking negative energy, or I'm gonna smuggle you up my butt until you smell how bad it is in there and realize you got it good. You know what? He's right. Fuck everything I said. If you have any, yeah. if you're sad you're or going mad, my butt. You, Elliot is going to vacuum. You're going. Elliot's asshole <laughs> is like a vacuum. He will vacuum you up there. Right. And right. so yeah, don't. Just like Santa Claus says, you better watch out. You better you not. Better watch out, or I'ma shank your ass, bitch. You better not cry or pout. Oh, you done oh, goofed, son. I think you just want to be Kazooie. You when when Santa Claus says that, he I means I know. I, 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 <laughs> don't interrupt me. When Santa Claus says you you better not cry or pout, he means you can never show any negative emotions ever. You can't you can't cry or be mad at anything. He, Santa Claus just wants you to suppress all of those emotions. Never go to therapy. Never go to counseling. Never open up with your family and friends. That's right. Don't pout at all. Just keep it all suppressed, and you will not get 
a shitty piece of coal for Christmas. That's right, be a good boy. Pro-life tip from Slick Frame and uh, uh, King Cletus. That's right. Fucking got it. What are we doing with our lives? <laughs> <laughs> Go in that window. No, the episode's over. No, go in that window. But it's ten minutes. Go in that window. I was trying to. <laughs>